Hi Scorpio, Daily Horoscope for May 31, 2023. A rational and serious attitude toward life is represented by the number 4, which represents Day 4. The horoscope for tomorrow suggests that Scorpios cut down on their professional activities and, even better, take some time off to relax. Enjoy a day of unwinding in a laid-back setting, and realize that chasing after short-term accomplishment is not the most essential thing to do in this life. The time during which the moon is in its waxing gibbous phase is connected to the process of rejuvenation inside the body, particularly within the liver, kidneys, and your genital system. You may assist your body in getting rid of all of the extra by avoiding overeating and drinking an increased amount of water. Now more than ever, Scorpios are exceedingly sensible and accepting of the flaws that others have. You are able to exhibit remarkable diplomatic abilities when the moon is in the sign of Libra, which will be of use to you in developing connections with other people. Take action that will be beneficial, such as cleaning and organizing an apartment. It is not required to begin a major makeover. Rather, you can just give the interior a little bit of a facelift. With only a few splashes of vivid color here and there, the space will come alive with fresh tones. Today, you should follow your instincts, but the most important thing is to take it easy on yourself since the stars are advising you to do so. If you push yourself too hard, you might end up hurting yourself. As the intuitive moon travels through Libra and your slumberous 12th house of the subconscious, she will be reaching out across the sky to form a galvanizing trine to the primal sun in your 8th house of financial security, which just so happens to be the most intense sector of your chart. While she is there, she will be reaching out across the sky to form a galvanizing trine to the primal sun in your 8th house of financial security. These transits are incredibly potent to say the least, but happily, the moon will be in a supportive aspect which will encourage them to exhibit their best sides and provide you with a wealth of energy that will slowly release itself during the day to assist you in getting through it. You want to be extremely clear on whatever job you do and double check it as often as necessary. With the moon in your subconscious domain, it's easy to overlook information. Take your time and don't try to push anything. Right now is the best time for you to talk to your lover about the emotions that you normally don't feel comfortable discussing since the atmosphere is just right. The moon is now located in the sign of Libra and in the 12th house. If you are not prepared to disclose any of your darker secrets with your spouse, it will be impossible for you to have a true relationship with them. It is common for us to believe that if we were to communicate certain things to our partners, they would run away from us. But the truth is that if the connection is one that is valuable enough to preserve, it will really bring the two of you closer together. How can you and your partner come to an agreement in which you both vow to be open and honest with one another while at the same time providing a secure environment for one another? The love horoscope for Scorpios encourages them to be prepared for any shocks that may come their way. It's possible that someone may surprise you by confessing something, or that you'll run across an old friend. You will need to pay a heightened level of attention to your surroundings tomorrow. Maintain your discretion at all times, show appreciation for those you hold dear, and do not be stingy with your praises. A passionate but brief love is what the love number 9 forecasts for you. You should avoid displaying intense emotion from the very first days of getting to know someone and should avoid imposing yourself in any manner that you can, as this will prevent the establishment of healthy relationships. The moon is now in the sign of Libra and in the 12th house. This shines a light on any covertly negative thoughts you may have about your job, feelings that may be holding you back from achieving the level of achievement you are capable of. Do you give yourself permission to acknowledge the aspects of your work that you find frustrating? You are the only one who can alter the things that make you miserable, and the only way to do so is for you to acknowledge those things and be clear about what needs to change. It is a lot simpler to deal with things that are in your field of consciousness rather than having them inadvertently sabotage your life. This is because working with things that are in your area of awareness is much easier. Concentrate on communicating with your co-workers since today is a good day for collaboration. However, make an effort to avoid discussing contentious issues. Instead, stick to using language that are commonly used. 
The horoscope for Scorpio's job warns of a brief occurrence involving stagnation in their personal relationships. In the not-too-distant future, you have a lot of labor that will hopefully bear fruit. When Mercury is in the sign of Taurus, it suggests that one's mind is clear. If you do not let yourself get sidetracked by little matters, you will have no trouble overcoming any challenges. Because the moon is still moving through your sign, now is not the time to engage in strenuous activity because you should be using this time to engage in profound introspection. Putting today's attention on you and what you need is a really significant task. Because things are going to pick up pace, it is essential to make the most of your time off and unwind. How much of your time and money do you spend on meeting your demands these days? Scorpio, it seems as if you have been placing quite an amount of strain on yourself recently, but now is the moment to rediscover a sense of equilibrium. When others are in a bind, they know they can count on you to help. Be careful to maintain your sense of perspective and equilibrium at all times, since the fulfillment of your own requirements is of equal significance. Today, Scorpio, you have a strong need for ease and warmth, so it would be best for you to just relax at home in your PJs. If you don't have a lot of responsibilities to take care of today, you should definitely take some time to rest both your mind and your body. If you take some time off for yourself, you'll find that you have more energy to devote to your job when you return. Because as right is a stone that strengthens intuition and insight, wearing it today will make it easier for you to listen to your gut impulses. If you're having trouble finding a fresh viewpoint today, try holding an azurite crystal in your left hand. The nutritional and fiber content of oats is quite high, and they also include a significant amount of beta-glucans. Oatmeal, whether prepared sweetly or savorily, is a hearty breakfast option that will help you, Scorpio, maintain your concentration throughout the day. You will be able to prevent unneeded tension and mental agony if you take advantage of today's emotionally favorable conditions. After today, Scorpios may put their whole faith in their gut instincts. If you are feeling fatigued and irritable, you should postpone all cases and schedule an appointment with a doctor as soon as possible. When the moon is in the sign of Libra, this is an excellent time to start a weight reduction program. This is not necessarily a regimented diet. A complex of specialized workouts is sufficient. In addition, the fragrances of orange and cinnamon will assist you in keeping a cheerful mood. Today there is a lot of energy in the sky, and although some signs will be able to use this to expand the breadth of their sexual lives, things are going to be a little bit more challenging for you. Because the intuitive moon is presently traveling through Libra and your slumberous twelfth house of the subconscious, it would not at all be unusual if you were having some difficulty feeling tuned into the energy that is occurring around you. During the course of the day, the moon will create a stimulating trine aspect with the elemental sun located in the 8th house of your chart. In this sort of alignment, you are going to have the need to take care of yourself first and foremost before attending to the requirements of anyone else, yet out of the blue, someone may provide you with an intriguing opportunity. Why not take the plunge and see where it takes you? I wish you a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.